1974 when we started the convention circuit. Don't be so nervous. I was scared in my mind when we started this. Not, not necessarily about being on stage, which I was nervous about, but also just, I didn't understand the concept of a convention, or I've never been to one as a fan, and I've never done a show that had a convention following, so I didn't understand the idea that my work on a show would lead me to be in front of a bunch of people talking about my work on the show. Everything I've ever done, I go, I shoot, it airs, and that's it. I don't know, there's no afterlife for it. And when I got invited to do conventions for Supernatural, I turned them down the first few times because I thought, why? I've done two episodes, what am I going to go talk to these people about? And I had this image of it being me at a folding table in the middle of a gymnasium with people just screaming by and not stopping at the wrestler, you know, like Mickey Roar from the wrestler. I thought, yeah, now I'll pass. Not so bad though. Turns out, go to a hotel full of people who actually like your work. Yeah. 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 I was asking me that question, I would be saying, it's a blast. Like, it's really, really, really fun. One of the great things, I don't want to, you know, speak for Jason, but I think we all concur on this, is the fandom, you, are awesome. This whole experience of getting to interact with, hang out with, entertain and bond with the people that keep the show alive, that watch the work, is phenomenal. It's super unique. You guys may not see it as unique because you come to these cons and you may go to Dr. Who cons and other things like that. But if you're an actor, if you're a performer, you're not, you don't exist in that universe, it's completely uncharted territory for you. So being exposed to this world is kind of phenomenal. Super cool, super fun. We wouldn't do it if it wasn't fun. Really, truly. We, we travel, we leave family, we do all these things. And we, we have so much fun doing this. You people are just a hoot. So it's always a pleasure. And I would, that's what I would tell my young self. Relax. It's going to be fun. Jason? Uh, I, I feel like there's a lot of things that I would want to tell myself similar to that. Like relax, have fun. Everybody's just, you know, it's really nice. Um, but I would be afraid to go back and mess anything up. Still, you know, a little surprised that I, I get to come to these things and play for you guys. And it's really, really fun. Uh, and it's one of those things where I just kind of look back and it's like, I don't really know how, where, what you change. Right. Yeah, I don't, uh, I like, I like that I'm here. So I wouldn't want to meddle because it might change. You know what I mean? Okay, then let me ask you this. What would you tell a new guy coming over the circuit who wasn't you? Uh, Somebody who was nervous, who was apprehensive. I, I have, uh, I've had a few of those scenarios where, you know, the, the new fellow comes in and, and uh, super nervous. And I just I tell him that. I say, hey, you know what? Get a shot at that face. Take a breath. That's always good advice. Yeah. That just lets the whole life work. No, but I, I would give him the same advice that I use yeah. myself when I'm playing. I had a show last night. Some people came up and said, you're so comfortable on stage. Like, it's just, you're so relaxed. It makes me relaxed. And I, I really get that from you guys. I mean, I feel like I've seen so many of you before five, six years now, that I really do when I'm on stage. I look forward to getting on stage. I don't really get that nervous. A little bit sometimes, but I don't really get that nervous because I look out and I see a familiar face that's smiling, and I'm just I'm just hanging out with friends. You know what I mean? I'm just the same as sitting in the living room jamming with my buddies. Like, I, I really enjoy it. So that would kind of be my advice. You know? <laughs>